Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Gill St. Bernard's is brought to you by Robert Wood Johnson University Hospital in Somerville. Gill St. Bernard's looks to continue its dominance in non-public B soccer. The Knights going for a fourth straight state championship. St. Rose, the South champion, looks to pull off the upset and end the Knights' reign. Gill applied the pressure right away. On the free kick, Jack Harmon in perfect position to make the save. Harmon would be a busy man throughout the state final. Late first half, the Knights on the corner, and there's Harmon again with another quality save. At the half, we are scoreless. Second half, the pressure continues for GSB, and once again, Harmon is in position. He cuts this one off to make another quality stop. St. Rose gets their best chance. James Vital has it past the keeper, but Dylan Palmieri is able to steer it off the line. Through 80 minutes, still no score. The state finals go to overtime. In OT, Gill continues its aggressive play. Harmon makes his best save of the match right here. The Knights outshot St. Rose 16 to three, but there will be no golden goal. 100 minutes of scoreless soccer. The non-public B state championship will be settled with penalties. Michael Dumius did not have much work throughout the match, but the Knights keeper shows up when it matters the most. Dumius with a save in the first round of penalties, and he's fired up. This really set the tone for Gil St. Bernard's. The Knights went on to convert three straight PKs. Nick Collins gives Gil St. Bernard's a 3-1 lead through three rounds. Jack Harmon is able to keep the Purple Roses in the match. This save is fantastic. Harmon finishes with 12 stops. It's 3-2 heading into the fifth round. Round five, St. Rose needs to convert to keep the match going, but it's Dubious with his second save in PKs, and it's a four-peat for Gil St. Bernard's. Michael Dubious faced just three shots in the first 100 minutes, but his busy work in PKs gives Gil St. Bernard's a state championship. Three to two is your final in PKs. The Knights close out their season with seven straight clean sheets. That's an amazing accomplishment. It's fitting that defense was the key to winning the state title. Yeah, it was definitely a challenge. I have completely trust in my defense. They held out throughout the whole tournament that we held them to our opponents to zero goals. It was a great feeling. And I, I was told to come up big by my coach, and I came up big. Going into it, we were definitely frustrated. They were playing really good defense on us, playing very solid, but we knew we had to just keep pushing, and that's what we've been told to do, and we just did it right, and at the end, it came out on top. Reporting from Franklin High School, I'm Rich Crampanis for JerseySportsZone.com.